So much fun to celebrate Hanukkah. What can a 2,000 year old holiday teach us about life today? Stay tuned to find out. From Aish, this is Jew Know It. I'm Sarah, and today we're talking about Hanukkah. And a reminder, if you like what we're doing here, hit that subscribe button to never miss an episode. Hanukkah celebrates the Jews' victory over Syrian Greeks 2,000 years ago during the time of the Second Holy Temple. And here's how that went down. The Syrian Greeks were super obsessed with themselves and tried to make the Jews be just like them by banning Jewish things like Shabbat and studying Torah. Rude. How rude! But some brave Jews known as the Maccabees said, um, I don't think so, and started a war against the Greek army. And then after many years of fighting and against huge odds, the Jews won. Hooray, victory! After the Jews took back the Holy Temple, they wanted to relight a special lamp, the menorah, but they could only find one tiny jar of oil. This tiny jar did something amazing. It burned for eight days. To remember this victory and the miracle of the oil, Jews celebrate Hanukkah for eight nights. What's Hanukkah mean to you? We'd love to hear in the comments below. The middle branch of the Hanukkah menorah is for the helper candle, AKA the Shamish. You light this one first and use it to light the others, adding one additional candle each night. But before you light, you wanna put your menorah in the right place, like next to your front door or facing a window so you can share the incredible story of Hanukkah with others. And then during the nights of Hanukkah, you light the menorah at nightfall, ideally with your family, and the candles should burn for at least 30 minutes. The point of lighting Hanukkah candles is to sort of publicize the miracle. Even in dark times, let your Jewish light shine. Hanukkah matters because it's a celebration of how the Jews stood up against this whole becoming someone else deal. It's like the Jews were saying to the Syrian Greeks, Hold up. we're staying true to who we are no matter what. And let's be honest, this message still hits home today. In a world where TikToks and IG filters make everything look perfect, Hanukkah reminds you to stay true to who you are. Now, while Hanukkah often joins the end of the year holiday mashup, that does not make it the Jewish Christmas. Hanukkah is its own thing just like the Jews were and still are. Allow Hanukkah to be a reminder of what it means to be Jewish when you're in a sea of different traditions. Get into the Hanukkah groove with some singing. One of the most well-known songs is Maotzor that goes to the tune of Rock of Ages. It's a victory anthem, sort of like the Jewish version of We Are the Champions. Play some dreidel, which is a spinning top with Hebrew letters on each side. Dreidel, 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 I made it out of clay. The letters stand for a great miracle that happened there, referring to the miracle of Hanukkah, obviously. Eat some food cooked with olive oil to celebrate the oil miracle of Hanukkah, like latkes and jelly donuts. Finally, you can also exchange gifts to share the joy of Hanukkah. But remember, it's also more important to be present than to get or give presents. But presents are fun too. Now go shine on, just like those candles on the menorah. I'm Sarah, and from Aish, this is Jew Know It, a series where we tackle questions big and small about Judaism, even the ones you're too afraid to ask. Hit that like and subscribe button to follow along and drop a comment with what topics you want us to cover next. See you next time.